What's up YouTube, it's Rebelable Productions today guys, I'm back with another video and this time I have a how to video on how to do muzzle effects on iMovie. So let's get started. First thing you want to do of course is open up Stop Motion Studio, of course I use Stop Motion Studio Pro, it doesn't really matter which one you use. Just get your shots ready for this, the guy shooting it, shooting the gun, and then have the other guy falling down just for like, you know, effect. And yeah, we're just gonna speed through this real quick. And this is what it should look like. All right, as you can see now, we need to get the muzzle effects. Now what I did was I went on the internet, searched up muzzle effects and put in PNG as well. And find ones that just make the shot look, make it look good on the shot, of course. And yeah, as you see now we're on iMovie. We now need to make the muzzle effect smaller of course put in picture and picture as well but also make the muzzle effect smaller like the clip of it and yeah make it line up with the shot you're trying to take so let's see so yeah now we're going to duplicate it because i want to do it more than once they can make more like an effect because i'm trying to shoot it more than once so yeah Alright, I think I'm going to duplicate it one more time, just to give a little bit more effect. So, yeah. Alright, now we have it for the third time. And yeah. So, I think this looks pretty good now. And yeah, let's speed up a little bit and I'm gonna show you guys the final results. Now that's the finals for adding the muzzle, but now we're gonna add some effects to it. And there you have it. That's how you add muzzle effects to your stop motion. And that's it, pretty much it, guys. If you guys need any more questions on how to do it or if you need any help, just put it down in the comment section below. But, anyways, guys, leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.